This week we're looking at some of the fun you can have with words and stories of your own. We visited poet Mike Rosen, who knows a thing or two about words, and we asked him, what if you wanted to speak a secret language? Hey! Hey! Well, hey, hello, everybody. Hello. But that's a boring thing to say, hello, everybody. You can make that more interesting. You know that word, everybody? What if you made that everybody word just a little bit more exciting, if you chopped it up into little bits, one letter at a time? And instead of saying everybody, you said everybody, very body, everybody, rye body, why body, body, oddy, die, why? <laughs> Now, that would be the slow version. If you speeded it up a little bit, it would go... Everybody, very body, everybody, rye body, why body, body, oddy, die, why? <laughs> and that's just everybody. And then you could take the word shampoo. Shampoo, hampoo, ampoo, empoo, poo, oo, oh! <laughs> Not a good idea at all. But what if you wanted to speak a secret language? Instead of just saying hello, you could say... h ki e ki el ki el ki ki jug <laughs> And that is hello in key jug language, where you take one letter at a time, you put key after each letter, and at the end, you say key jug. H key e key l key l key o key jug. Anyone like to say their name in key jug language? How about you? R key o key b key y key n key jug. Robin? Yes! <laughs> but that's only one way of doing it. I could give it to you in backslang. So instead of saying, my name is Mike, I would say, I may, a man a, c a, I can a. Take the front letter off, put it on the end, and add in a. I may, a man a, c a, I can a. Anyone here speak back slang? Yeah. You can. Let's hear yours then. Mother guy never game if it gets to the game. And what did you just say? My name is Zane. So that was like other gay language. Yeah? Yeah. Give him a clap as well. <laughs> I've got a bit of a problem, look. This. What do you think that is? Spoon. But it's got a forky bit. So what is it? It's a fork spoon. But what if I wanted to call it something special? That had both the spoon and the fork in it. I could call it a spork. <laughs> or maybe it's a foon. What do you think? A foon or a spork? Spork. <laughs> I went to the doctors and I said, Doctor, I've got an ache in my bacon. He said a bacon. I said, yeah, the bacon. Bacon and egg. Leg. There it is. My bacon. Chalk farms. Arms. And these, you know what these are? Elastic bands, hands, <laughs> plates of meat, feet. <laughs> you know what that is? That's my barnet fair. My hair. Now remember, that's a secret language, so not a dicky bird to anyone. Dicky bird word. That's it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hey! 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 Hey!